Hi, my name is Mason Price, and I chose to do the Hey Little Ant Project. Stop. First, I'll tell you about their movements. They walk in a straight line by smelling pheromones left behind by other ants from their colony. They move together and work together. When leaving the ant colony, they are in search of food to bring back to their colony. Tawny slash raspberry crazy ants will travel up to 18 feet or 550 centimeters from their head. Animal. There are three different types of adults and each type has a different reason for moving or leaving their colony. The worker ants will go out in search of food. They will use their antenna to smell for food and water. The worker ants will also work together to build their ant hills using sand. The queens will stay in the colony to lay eggs. Next, I'll tell you about the lifespan. The worker ants in the colony can live between 76 to 84 days. The queen ants will live for several years. Their colony can have multiple egg layings. Now I'll tell you about their food. Tiny crazy ants are omnivores and will eat almost anything. Their diet includes keeping aphids as pets for the honeydew they produce, sweet parts of plants, fruits, honey from bees, small insects, and small mammals. Now I'll tell you about their behavior. Tawny crazy ants get their name from their crazy behavior. They can take over other ant colonies, including the red imported fire. Their basic now I'll tell you about their basic needs. Tawny crazy ants need food, water, and air, and shelter to live to, in order to survive. Now their environment. Tawny crazy ants prefer to live in damp areas. They will make their nest under rocks and inside holes if, or anywhere that is moist. Now I'll tell you about their predator. Their predator, their main predators are toads. They have an ability to make their own anti-venom, which protects them from bites from red imported fire ants. The last thing I had to do, do for my project is write a letter to discuss if they should be controlled or if they should not be controlled. Here is my letter. I am writing to you today to discuss the tawny crazy ant, also known as the raspberry crazy ant. These ants are getting out of control and we need something and we need to do something about it. They need to be controlled. Here are the reasons why we need to control this ant species. First, they can be really noisy because there's usually a lot of them and they can be very fast, scatter like crazy and will even bite. That's where they got the name. Next, if these ants get into your house, they can damage pipes or, or anything that has water inside. These ants go crazy for water. If you think that damaging pipes is bad, wait until I tell you how much these guys ruin electrical wires. No wires safe around these guys. The last and, mo and most important reason is they are invasive species. This means they aren't from here and they damage the local environment. Please consider controlling this species of ant. A concerned citizen, Mason Price. Thank you for listening.